If you are into the practical, the electric, or the nostalgic, chances are you will find the vehicle for you at this year's Michigan International Auto Show. News 8's Joe Lafergi is live for us at DeBoss Place with a preview, Joe. Hi, Michelle. Well, the charity spectacular benefiting Helen DeVos Children's Hospital underway right now. The show opens to the public tomorrow. It's one thing to find the car of your dreams online. Quite another to actually sit behind the wheel. Vehicles are such an emotional purchase, right? They are an extension of your personality to a degree. So you want to be able to sit in, feel it, drive it before you do buy it. That's what the Michigan International Auto Show provides. It's the 25th year for the show. Electric vehicles are the big star, like the Ford F-150 Lightning and the Mach-E. We also have the Cadillac Lyric. That's kind of like the showcase this year. To actually have that here, you can't even see it in a dealer showroom. Along with the latest models, the show features the Michigan Auto Salon and its exotic vehicle collection. The Gilmore Car Museum is back. Another brand new feature that kind of celebrates the journey, you know, the road, if you will, to where we are today with electric starts with a vehicle from 1903, the Columbia. There's also displays featuring West Michigan's contribution to the auto industry. In addition to that, we have a lot of companies, tier one, two, three, the manufacturers that get tickets for their teams so that the local employees who are really making the components that are on these vehicles out here can come down to the show and see their work. The show opens to the public tomorrow at 11. For ticket and time information, just go to woodtv.com.